Major money coming to Florida to help communities and their infrastructure. ABC 27's Alexa Trishler tells us who's getting what and how much. $750,000 is coming to Taylor County to give the community a better quality of life. Help them to be able to live a little bit better. At least 11 homes in the unincorporated parts of the county will see much needed funding to fix or tear down rundown homes and give temporary assistance for relocation in the process. Today I announced $29 million uh, statewide. Governor Ron DeSantis announced the Florida Department of Economic Opportunities Small Cities Community Development Block Grant Program, which will give several Big Bend communities the means to rehabilitate homes to improve poor living conditions. Uh, we're in bad need right now. Homes in Taylor County that are in bad shape that belong to the elderly, disabled, and low-income earners will be pushed to the front of the line. Some of the people we have here that's on the low end of the totem pole that don't have air conditioning, windows are not good, and, and some need tops or roofs, as you might, and some of this money would help, help those folks out to help their living, the standard of living much better. In addition to today's rollout, the county will get a separate grant for around $20,000 to help attract future investments. This is part of another development grant from Enterprise Florida, the agency giving the money. The governor believes in building up the workforce, the infrastructure, and businesses need to know about the treasures here in Taylor County. Liberty and Madison counties will both be seeing $700,000 each coming down the pike to rehab homes, part of this block grant program. In Taylor County, Alexa Trishler, ABC 27. Now, details to apply for the grant are still up in the air, but anyone living in a poor quality situation can apply. Right now, county leaders are in the process of how that will look.